Now uh, the other thing I wanted to do is show you my test bed. Uh, this is going to be kind of necessary because you'll notice that this is made out of, of slats, if I could get there, with a fairly regular, that's it, every one and three eighths inch. Just for an idea of scale. We'll be back. Always mark your polarities. Alrighty, here we go. We've got the uh, the new Eat It the Y Gate. <laughs> yeah, regular regular Mayonnaise uh, array going up that way. And then on this side, um, I really need to work on this since they just grew up together, but we had opposite polarities south, 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 north, 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 south, south, south. But obviously it's given up, so hold on for a moment. All right, we had to do a little modification because the two-sided tape just wasn't enough to keep it down there, and I'm not sure that that's an array of enough, but uh, I wanted to finally give it a try because I've been chomping at the bit here. Let's see what happens that. Looks like we're hitting our, our wall. Oh. Wow, now let's try this out. Huh. Hmm. Let's go further. There's no bounce. Oh, well, very little bounce. Mm. Oh, let me try it again a different way. Oh, whitey then, we've been doing some experiments. Uh, we tried a, a Y-gate of a different type down at that end, and it's still not particularly working as well as we'd like. Uh, what I had seen was a video from Smokey2, who had shown a one-way gate, which is this assembly without either of the ends. It's just these. And the uh, polarities of either side are running in opposite directions. So this would start with south and with north. This would start with uh, south and with north. And so depending on your roller mag, that would uh, decide how you go in there. But right now I'm kind of playing with the roller mag, finding out what happens when I close the loop of, magne of uh, magnetic flux. You know, what's, what's going to happen? Much weaker than than usual, as you can see. I can get it out of things, but I can't really get it off the plane. Oh, well, sometimes I can, depending on how much uh, force I've put into it. But uh, we're going to try a couple things with this and see what goes on. Hold on, please. All right, we've open ended one of uh, one ends of the gate down here, and we're kind of playing with the, the roller, seeing what it would do. Uh, it's aligned correctly. You have to start it up just far enough that it's not going to be attracted to the end. So you got to be <clears throat> in the flux to be able to get this. Let's see. There we go again. As you can see, it just need to be far enough into the flux for that one way or this particular side gate to happen. So I'm wondering if I can marry this and this to get out. <laughs> We'll try some more stuff. Be back. Hola. 
you'll see that we now have the uh, the newest design from Archer laid out with tape. We're going to do it one array at a time and then test array, test array, test. And it's going to take a long time. It's going to be a pain in the butt. But I got the Olympics on, so I, you know, I'm going to be sitting anyway. I can I can live with that. But you'll see that uh, each of these is uh, 15 pieces of tape long, except for this one, which actually had to be extended to 17 since I freehanded this. Um, the 17 will be the last populated. We'll be using the one inch by uh, quarter N40 Neos, and we'll see what happens. Stay tuned, kids. Well, we're finding out that 15 is just not enough. If we take our bad boy cylinder magnet and we try to get it unstuck from the tape, <clears throat> get it lined up. Let's see. It's not even thinking about it. The end is too close. I'm going the other way. Still hitting the wall. We'll be back after we extend this and see how that works. Well, after playing around and looking at Bulls and Bears video again, I did see that there are some things that are way different. First off, his lengths, he's meeting up just about halfway, which is probably be back here, one of these two. And this is shorting out with its uh, attracting end. Now, uh, see, the, the hard part I have with that is this two-sided tape is it's strong, but it's not that strong. And so, I do a full way that way, I do a full way this way, but I do not get intersecting juice. Because I don't have it right yet, so we'll try this again tomorrow. But, I'm going to have to relay this thing out. Talk to you later. Bye.